Hello! Welcome to the Generational Gamer. J Prime, today we are going to play some Fantasy Zone. Now, I have this on the NES and the Sega Master System, and now on the Genesis Mini, and probably somewhere else as well. And it's a pretty cool game. I like it a lot. So, I figured, what the hell? I wanted to play the arcade version. And I did. And here it is, in all its glory. Let me check one more thing. Alright, so let's give this game a try. I'm going to turn down the audio of the game itself, and I'm going to hopefully entertain people. And we shall see. I'm going to play as J Prime. Now I'm sitting in my office, so I have a light directly above my head. But I chose this place just because I wanted to set it up. You know, I just realized my OBS is not doing any th kind of audio. Oh yeah, there we go. Slight delay, we'll bring it back. Okay, so let us see what we've got going on. I am going to, one, log into my own stream, so I hopefully don't screw it up royally. I'm still kind of new to all of this, and I haven't done one of these in a while, so bear with me, folks, please. my videos all right so we've got several different modes in this game and I've played some of them not too many time attack mode honestly I haven't gotten past the first level yet I suck at this game but I might have to try up up just because Opa Opa I get screwed on every single time but one of the things I like about these games is the fact they've got a built-in manual. Now, in truth, it's really not built-in. It's actually just taking you to the Sega Ages website. And the truth of the matter is, if you go to this website right here, it'll take you to the manuals and you can digitally download them, which is awesome. And apparently, Amazon has something to do with it. All right. So let's take a look at our manuals. We're going to go to North America because that's where I am. And I have most of these games. I have that one, have that one. Have that one, have that one, and have that one. But let's take a look at this. And I may do another one for, for uh, Shinobi as well. So let's switch over to the cursor mode. And now we can just navigate through. And I love that. So A is your rapid shot. Y is just your regular shot. You can change your weapons. I didn't know you could do it on the fly. But that's only an upa upa. So that's the switch version of it. One thing I noticed in this versus the uh, Space Harrier game, the Space Harrier game actually has the ability to expand your screen, and it actually does a decent job of it. Where this one, it kind of stretches it a little bit. Space Harrier, it looks like it's just adding to the side of the screen. But anyway, beggars can't be choosers. So here's the details about the game. Uh, we're not going to do that. We are going to go back to next. Original mode. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you've got a ranking system, which I bet would be more impressive if it were on a console that actually had trophies. Come on, Nintendo, add trophies, dang it! And there's your difficulty. I'm still playing on default because I suck. And this is what I was talking about. So, with the display modes, yeah, you got some options, but I'm not seeing a huge difference. And then you've got the saving and all that other good stuff. And your weapon, and your bomb, and your move. So... There's your story, and it's an arcade game, so it doesn't really have much of a story. And then you can, after a round, you can take change at your coin stock. That's pretty handy. So basically, you can level yourself up when you first start a game. Pretty sweet. So you destroy the bases, and then you have a boss battle. You gotta find their weak spot. Obviously, I have not found their weak spot, at least on the first one. And I usually get my name on there, but that's just because nobody else has played it. 
And this is kind of how I play it with mine because I don't like the stretching. I don't like being stretched. And there's that, and there's all your power-up parts. And you can get an extra ship, which I desperately need because I royally suck at this game. So there's Uppa Uppa, which is apparently the little brother or the sibling of Opa Opa. Seriously, where the hell did these names come from? Sega, I know. So you can select your weapon, you can change your weapon in the list. I guess that's just Uppa Uppa mode. Alright, cool. In time attack, you just try to move how fast you can possibly move. Blah, 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 and that is it. So let's go back, shall we? Yes, we can. How the hell do you end this? X. Yes, the screen will be closed. So let's do original mode. Insert coin, so you hit X. Oh, you know what? Let me stop for one second. I am going to show the different screens right here so you hit you hit X and it takes you into all this fancy shit so here's your display mode okay so there's normal where it gives a nice big screen here let's uh how the hell do you let it see you so you want to see what it looks like there's normal all right so there's normal and the display details there's the vintage where it looks like it's on a CRT, maybe in an arcade cabinet. But you can also change the cabinet so you can make it look like stuff. Blah, blah, blah. There's all your cabinet types. Whoopee! All right. And then you got normal, your display details, which is phenomenal. And I want type A because it tells you everything. So then you can turn your details off, your scan, your display effects. I don't care for scan lines. I never did. I like smoothing, so that's just me. And then you've got your normal. Again, everything's just zoomed in, which looks okay, I guess, if you're on a big screen. And there, if you want it to fit, then at that point, I guess you do want to turn them off, because then it just looks like ass. And then there's full. You can see it's, uh, you can see it, it's stretched now. And that just isn't kosher with me, so we're not going to do that. So, display effect off. We're going to go back to normal. We're going to put the wallpaper back on type A. I guess we'll do display details so I can see everything. Now, it's a whole lot easier when I look at it on my 40, uh, my 50 some inch TV. But, for on my little monitor, it's perfectly adequate. So, let's hit X. And I'm not doing the coin charge. I mean, it feels like a pretty good authentic port of the arcade game. I like it. I suck at it, but I like it. Now, I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to get in the parts shop. I usually buy wings, and I usually buy a decent weapon. I don't have enough money for this. do Laser beam. And we'll exit. And we're actually not going to use any of these right now. So let's exit out. Ooh, let's get some money. How am I doing? I don't know how I'm doing. I always like seeing Snoopy running around, but they give you coins, so why not go for them? And the little scissor things, these things, they give you coins. Get back here, I want my coin. Ah, damn it. Alright, let's try this shit again. Yeah, I just dropped a load on him. Let me get more money. Thank you. There we go. Look at me. You know what? Turbo really helps on here. Let's kill Snoopy. Rapid firing the hell out of this shit. Whoop. I want my money. Huh. 
How am I doing? Oh, I think I got everybody. Now let's fight this guy. I'm killing his vomit. I beat him! That is the first time I've ever beaten this dude. Oh, let me get money. Oh, I lost my money. Oh, I just went to the shop. Well, I'm getting another ship because I suck. And I've never done this before. Oh, there's this is what the bases look like now? Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, get away from me, asshole. Take that. Let's kill these uh, fist-looking Snoopies. Oh shit, I'm getting my ass handed to him here. I'm about to. Yeah, take that. Hey, oh shit, they shoot back. Bastards. I want that money! Oh, gotta dodge that shit. Oh, fudge! They got me. They got me! I was actually doing pretty good, too. Oh, let me get my money. They shoot. Hey, that's just scenery. Take that. Take that, scenery. Take that. Let's go to that shop. Whew! I can get an extra ship. Oh shit, no I can't. Dag gum. Hello, whoever joined me, welcome. Let's use that laser beam. Give that one a try. Oh shit, it runs out. Take that, and get us get rid of that one too. I got one more. I gotta wrap around the track. Got him. And now I'm back to my crappy little pea shooter. Who's fighting me now? Oh shit! What the hell? Alright, this is old school fudge. This is some old school hard right here. Ah, damn it. <laughs> Game over. Look, J Prime not doing so bad now. Not doing so great, but not doing so bad. Let's try Uppa Uppa. Whatever whatever the hell that mode is. Yay, it was recorded for ranking. Hallelujah. Welcome to Uppa Uppa mode. You will not only begin by selecting an engine, you'll also be able to toggle between weapons displayed on the left and right sides. Alrighty then. So basically, you get charged for using your weapons. Yep, yep, yep. I see, I see, I see.
Charge your gold from the coin stock beforehand. All right. Here's a gift as a first-time bonus. Alrighty then. Ooh. Engine select. That's a pretty nice. Uh, let's try the rocket engine. What the hell? I don't know. I've never. Uh, I can't select any of them. All right. All right, I'm the rocket engine now. Hey, look how little he is. Oh, holy shit, that's fast. All right, I don't care for the rocket engine. He's way too fast. Way too fast. Way, way, way too fast. Alright, how the hell do you switch off the damn rocket engine? Take that, Snoopy. dropped a bomb there. Take that, Snoopy. Way too fast. Ah, crap. Don't! Not doing so well. I'm gonna try that again, though. Gotta add my J Prime. Yeah, let's stick with the big wings. Way too fast for my uh, tastes here. Take that. Yeah, I can actually control the damn thing now. A fudge. Ah, crap, Ola. Ah, damn it. How can I die? Actually, I think you get unlimited lives in this as long as you have freaking gold. God damn. Not my finest moment. Take these scissors out. I don't remember anything being so damn aggressive in the actual arcade game. Ah, shit. Game over! No! Alright, let's add my J Prime in there. Let's try that again. 
Let's try the jet engine. I suck at this anyway. I might as well give it a whirl, right? Oh, that's not too fast. I can handle that one. Take that. Damn it. I don't know what the six out oh, six out of ten is how many I have left to destroy or how many or how many are left. Shit. Not my finest move. How about we change this to Fantasy Zone and Shinobi? Mainly because this game's starting to piss me off. Submitting my upper upper mode. Here we go. Alright. By the way, for the record, I do not care for this game. I love that game. Let's try some Shinobi. I remember those eyes from Revenge of Shinobi. Hit any button, and I shall. So let's check out the manual on this one real fast. You are not going to believe this. It is the same damn thing. Look at that. And there's the Shinobi manual. Let's look at the let's look at the cursor. Well, look at that. So ninjutsu is your magic, and attack is Y, and the top buttons don't do jack shit. Arcade mode, modes and ages mode. Sweet. Ranking, play replay. I suck at this game too. International or Japan. Honestly, I don't know the difference. If somebody ever sees this and wants to tell me, please let me know. So we're going to save. We don't care. Stage select. Do you really get to select your stage? Oh, you've previously played. Oh well. So missions and stages are identical in both. In the Ages mode, it takes two hits to lose a life, and your attacks are also powered up from the onset. This is suitably reflected in your choice of attire. The fabled gaudy ninja, as they are known, is so deadly and stealthy they purposely clothe themselves in gar garish colors. Just to show off, really. Alrighty then. The melee. Assign a button to punch and kick attacks only for a different take on the gameplay. There's no rapid fire setting for this attack. Alrighty then. Ninjutsu. So there's three types. You've got the eight hands, the lightning, and the tornado. Alrighty. Oh, I didn't know you could reverse time. The rescue of the ninja cubs. Okay. I thought it was like Michael Jackson's Moonwalker. Alright, whatever. Defeat the bone the boss to enter the bonus stage. Alright, shit, let's do that. So there's a life system in the ages mode. So your ninja wear turns red. And you'll lose your life if you're red and you get hit. Alrighty. There's your lives remaining. 
your secret Navi, but I do not know what that is. Alrighty then. Saving replay data, yeah, yeah, yeah. And beautiful. So let's see, playing the game. Let's find out what the hell secret Navi is. Do you see it? I don't see it. Special bonus and secret Navi. Clear a stage without using a shuriken or any other throwing weapon for a special bonus. Okay. I still, after all these years, find it weird when you have a Nintendo game, or a Sega game, on a Nintendo console. Alright, we'll use the International. Let's check this out. I got HD Rumble on. Alright, so let's see. Fit, full, and this one stretches it too. I don't like that. Cabinet, vintage, normal, dot by dot, whatever the hell that is. Ah, shit. Dot by dot. I don't know what that is. That. See, smoothing. That looks too damn blurry. I actually like that one off. Let's do fit. And smoothing that looks blurry as hell and we're gonna turn off the wallpaper I think because it looks like ass let's give it a try now I'm gonna get my ass handed to me here but that's okay pursue the terrorists alrighty then Ah, shit. Crap. Go on to the next stage and I just died. What the freaking hell, my man? This is already further than I've ever been in this game. I like how your shurikens can't hurt them. Hey, take that, Spider-Man. Man, I'm kicking some ass now. Or maybe not. I gotta fight a boss now. What the fuck do you do with that? Take that, boss. Crap. Alright, let's try that shit again. Ah, damn it. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Let's enter, let's enter coin. Let's give it another try. Ooh. Crap! <laughs> Alright, let's try that shit again, man. I'll tell you what. Crap. This is where a second hit would really come into play. Boom. I think I got him this time. Boom! He went down. Mission cleared. 
Mission one, finish. Ooh, challenge for an extra player. Oh, I just got kicked. I failed. I knew I would. Enter the enemy's hideout. I pushed the wrong button. How the fuck do you do this? I died. I wonder how many times I can do this. I just got mail. Take that. That's a nice touch. I remember from uh, Revenge of Shinobi. I wonder where it originated. Take that. I'm going in! Stage cleared. This is the furthest I've ever been in this game. Because I don't think the crappy NES version counts as a real Shinobi game. And I don't mean the one by Sunsoft, I mean the one by Tengen. I didn't even see that son of a bitch. So when I, when I first started the stream today, I was going to try to be funny and reference Woody Woodpecker. And I didn't. And I feel bad about that. Because I was going to start off by, guess who? <laughs> and I didn't do that. And then I was going to talk briefly about Woody Woodpecker and how phallic his name is. And then I was going to talk about his, his friends, like uh, Chili Willy. Who's also phallic in nature by name. Oh, son of a bitch. And then I was thinking, did he have a walrus friend? Because I remember Chili Willy was a penguin. But they were never in the show together. And then I started thinking of Mr. Woodchuck from Full House. And how he liked wood. Ah, damn it. And... Given the phallic nature of this original conversation I was planning to initiate... I was going to reference, what did he have, a, a walrus friend named Phallus? And then the whole thing about Chili Willy, and uh, you know what cold does, shrinkage and all. Thank you, Jerry Seinfeld. And I have shrinkage, I have shrinkage. I was in the pool, I was in the pool. I remember being in the pool once. Nah, I'm just messing around. Jump up there, you silly shinobi. I don't know where the hell to go now. Take that. Take that. Take that. And then I really hope my kids aren't watching this ever because I say all these inappropriate things. And my son, he'll tell me. He goes, Daddy, don't say things that are inappropriate. I might repeat them. Well, son, if you know they're inappropriate, don't repeat them. And then that means the onus is on me. Oh, crap. There we go. Got that guy. Boom. We're moving up. Hey, this level looks like something I have seen. Oh, shit. That, that was complicated. I didn't know you could keep going, though.
Ah, oh, dang it. So I don't know if these games are worth like eight bucks a piece, but they are pretty damn fun. And uh, I haven't even played the easier version yet. Which I have to give a whirl. You just have to be quick with this shit. A oh, fudge. I died. Do. I'm gonna let that end. I'll just put my name in there. I'm not particularly proud of the fact that I had to do that all those times just to get my dang name in there. J. Prime. Oh, it only does three. Okay. This is a game from the 80s, so it makes perfect sense. There I am. Well, shit. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. Yay, my score was recorded. Bitchin'. No, I don't want that game res- Oh, shit. Boop! Rebooted. Let's try that ages mode. You know, the easy mode. Pursue those terrorists. Look at me, I'm kicking ass already. You know, Shadow, this this game makes Shadow Dancer make a... Oh, you son of a bitch. Make Shadow Dancer make a whole lot more sense because it's a one-hit kill and you're rescuing children again. Go to the next stage. Well, by Georgie, I'm trying. I wonder if I get back my white suit. Yes, I do. Rescue the little child, what I think is a child. I have no freaking idea. It doesn't seem all that different than... Come on, Spider-Man, get the fuck out of here. It doesn't look all that much different than Moonwalker. Except the main character is a tad different. Boom. Alright, now we're at the boss. Boom. Let's use that and take his ass out. Boom. Hey, you know what? This game's a whole lot easier when you play it with the ages mode. I might actually be able to beat the damn game. Take those shirkins, fellas. Ah, he got me. With the magical hand. Mission two. Mission two. Enter the enemy's hideout. Well, alrighty then. Let's give that thing a whirl. Oh, you son of a bitch. Take that. Hey, your life restores when you rescue a ninja kid. Let's go in! You know what? The same thing happens in Moonwalker. Every time you rescue a child, Michael Jackson improves in health. It's a fun game, I don't care. I know his legacy, but 
It's a fun game. Ah, damn it. I died! My first death! I almost said a bad word, and I apologize greatly. I never should use such dangerous language. Wonder, oh, you have to rescue two children. Well, s son of a bitch. Oh, fudge me. Stage clear. Am I fighting a... Oh, I'm going into this now. And I start off with my white suit again. Ah, fuck. Oh, shit, I used bad language. Damn it! God damn it. Sorry! Language warning. This is not for children. And I use multiple profanities. Son of a bitch! Hey, I was walking on water! I don't think my wife would believe me. Oh, you can walk on water. Yep. Son of a bitch. And you know why I know that? Because she always says, Honey, you can't walk on water! And I say, I'm aware. Take that. Son of a bitch. Ah, you damn bastard little mother. Father, sister, brother. So right now I am stellar in the cellar. God dang. Son of a mother bastard. Son of a biscuit. Take that. Gotcha. Boom. Boom. I right, know another one's coming. Another one bites the dust. Another one bites. Hey, I made it, but barely. Am I fighting a boss now? Yes, I am. A helicopter, no less. Let's see if it kills this thing. I beat it! With two hits! So, I don't know. I consider that cheating. How about you? <laughs> Welcome to this stage. Take that. I'm actually doing surprisingly well with this shit. Ah, oh, damn it. The last one. <laughs> I failed. Attack the logistic base. Damn it. Oh, uh, Rambo just killed me. Alright, we'll try one more time. Take that, Rambo. Get up behind those sons of bitches. Damn it. Gotcha. Ah, damn it. The blue guy sunk me. Alright, I'm gonna finish out this game and I'm gonna end this stream. Anybody who watched, thank you. Anybody who didn't watch, uh, maybe next time.
Hopefully I entertain somebody besides myself. Son of a bitch. Get. All right, my last life. Oh, never mind. Just got another life. I don't know what I did to deserve it, but I did. Oh shit, he's got a fucking grenade. Ah, you bastard. How dare you hit me? I don't appreciate that in the least. Up here it's a lot safer. Or not. Well, I spend most of my time talking to myself, but that's okay. If somebody watches this down the line, I greatly appreciate you doing so. And hopefully you can tell me where I'm going wrong. And I know it's somewhere because I am still screwing up this game. So have a good one, and peace out. Bye.